Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to be cutting and tapping, I guess I should say drilling and tapping some PVC pipe. I've got a project where I need to add some threaded PVC inserts into a pipe to provide some additional condensation type draining, you know, nothing pressurized, anything like that. So today I went out and I purchased a National Pipe Threads tap as a three quarter and we're gonna drill and tap this pipe. Uh, I set up a test so I can practice on some uh, some used pipe before I go into the real pipe. But uh, I just went ahead and filmed the test to show you how I drill and tap PVC. Let's get to it. Okay guys, here's the tools I used. I used a, a file set uh, to file down the inside of that. Um, I got this tap at Tractor Supply, I'm at local store. Uh, if you're doing PVC and piping thread, you're going to want to look for this thread type. This is uh, MPT National Pipe Thread, 14 threads per inch. There's different kinds. There's coarse, there's fine. If you want to do pipe, you definitely just need to stick to the, the MPT. And these are the types of threads here. They're a little bit more coarse than, than the other types of threads. I use 7 8 inch spade bit. Now, tap itself calls for a 5964. Good luck finding that one. You probably have to order that online. Uh, 7 8 is really close, probably just a tad bit too small, so it's going to make it a little more difficult to get your tap in. Um, I also used just a regular adjustable wrench to put on the, uh, the head of my tap to get it to turn. Uh, my tap wrench uh, wasn't big enough for this device. I used this a really small drill bit for a pilot hole. Alright guys, I'm going to try to file out those little inconsistencies there in the hole to make the tap go in better. All right, I think that's better. Right, we're gonna take our tap, see if we can get that started. Now I have my piece that I've already made that's going to actually go into my threads. I'm just going to test it out. You're going to want to use Teflon tape when you go for your final. Perfect for me, where it just comes through a little bit. And when I put Teflon tape on that, that'll prevent any leaks. Um, I'm not going to have to modify this by cutting holes or drilling when it's inside the pipe at that level. I think this is going to work perfect. Hey guys, uh, that's all we have for today. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any input on how you drill and tap PVC, let me know. Leave a comment below. Uh, this is how I do it. This works for a lot of other plastics too. Um, you know, any other type of plastic you want to drill and tap if you're making something. So thanks for watching. Uh, we will see you next time.